actually now I'm very nervous because my client ko is a public speaker, very well known sa NBA, a host. So, sana magawa ko ng maayos yung walk through ko ngayon with this vlog. So, we're going inside the loft. Actually, bachelor's pad siya. Nakita pala gift ko sa kanya. Actually, all of my clients. Shout out sa Alin Tap Tap for making these. So, all of my scents are quirky. This one is all apple pie. Lahat ng clients ko starting now is my gift sila from me after the renovation. Ayun na pala. Ayun Motorcycle journalist, a host, a retired race car driver, and most importantly, he's single right now. Hi, ladies. <laughs> <laughs> so we're doing is uh, his bachelor pack. So that's the reason why you're doing this video. Hindi naman. Hindi naman easy. Hindi na realize ko mga pala bachelor pa at single nga siya. So we made this project for you yeah. because number one, your problem was. You don't have places for your precious stuff. You have bank card, you have like your trophies. Yeah, so just to give you a, a quick backstory. When I moved in here, I wasn't really supposed to be in here. My mom and I went into this project eight years ago uh, thinking that we would rent it out. So it's split at 50-50. And then, so it was my job to furnish it. It was my job to do the finishing and all that kind of stuff. And because I knew I wasn't supposed to live here, I went cheap. So I got the cheapest furniture, I didn't really do anything with the walls, I just bare minimum. And then after I stayed here for a couple of weeks, um, I convinced my mom that I'll stay here now. hour. It wasn't really the way I wanted it, right? It was very basic and it had stuff that I didn't really like. In fact, the furniture was from a friend who moved into Rockwell and she didn't like her stuff, so I bought everything. I just, I just bought everything she had and then I just used the furniture and I mean, she didn't like it, I didn't like it, but it was just there. So through the years, little by little, I kind of changed some of the furniture. I kind of started to do a couple of things that I wanted to do, but it still wasn't exactly how I wanted it. Like you said, I didn't have any storage space, I didn't have any place for artwork that I have. Mm -hmm. And it kind of, it didn't feel like it was home. Yeah. You know, it didn't feel like it was... It was, you. It was me. Also. Yeah. <laughs> so I finally, when because of the pandemic, I realized, you know what? Two years, I'm at home so much. I need to do it now. Otherwise, I won't. I'll never do it, and I'll just be living in a place that I just don't like. You know, I had some ideas about the place. Eva mentioned, mm -hmm. my friend Eva mentioned that he, you were fixing his place. Yeah. Him and Grace. Can I just talk to her and see? Her, <laughs> see. Actually, random language. See, see, see if, what her ideas are. Just, it's gonna work, right? yeah. So and then and then you guys started fixing it. So yeah, it's here we are. And my question is, are you happy with your space? Absolutely, absolutely happy with it. I mean, and, but I sit down on the couch and I'm like, wow, look at my place. It actually, <laughs> it feels like me. You know, I yeah. see all my stuff around. I see uh, whether it's the stuff I've collected through the years, um, through and then some of the trophies that I've I've, I've won. Some of the artwork that's on display. I mean, it's it feels like me. Yeah. Oh. I, when I got in, parang wala character. And Gino Rufino, kasi his personality is very very special. Like you, you know some people na malakas yung dating. Tapos when I <laughs> pag pohas ko, hmm, wala personality yung house. Hindi ba kaya sa kanya? But I wanna point out uh, lala because when you walked in, you have to remember this was yeah, pandemic uh -huh. time, and I was fixing the place. My dining table was against the wall with my computer. My dining table was like my Zoom, was my uh -huh. Zoom meeting For slash studio. Here. Yeah, so parang it was really amazing. In fact, when I showed you the video, it's like, we don't judge me. Because it's so cool. Like, my place is not normally this bad, but it was that bad when you when you came in and um, you guys did a fantastic job. Then also, the problem was lighting. Actually, well, I took it for. Actually, pag enough yan, wait, sa sapwal lang now. Diba, parang walang dating. But now there is. 
Actually, upstairs, meron din kami ginawa, pero walls lang. Like, distressed walls for him. I, I like it. I mean, I've, I've always liked bricks. Yes. I've it's always a... liked cement, and I love the distressed look. That's very you. Yeah, that's very me. So, a lot, a lot of brick, a lot of cement, a lot of metal, wood. Those are really my elements. Actually, Caesar, pag when he says that, he's like very bold and masculine, industrial, rustic. And that's real rustic. Yun yung actually the design namin for him. And very eclectic din siya. Like, um, also like a huge geek. Meron siyang <laughs> geek room. Actually, office. Super, super, super. Absolutely. Star Wars. I can relate kasi ako mga Batman. Well, yeah. parang may collection din ako na super dami. I still need a room because I still do podcasts. I still do shows online. And I needed a room. Um, where I would do that. So my computer, from which was in my living room slash dining room, is now upstairs in my second bedroom slash guest room slash office. And it's against a wall that has a lot of different stuff. Like you said, I'm a, I am a big geek. And I do love Star Wars. I do love... Parang sila Eva lang. Parang Eva. Eva and I get along. We don't just get along because of motorcycles. We get along because we're both big geeks. He's bigger. <laughs> but, but literally. No, um, but... But, <laughs> but, but yeah, so it has a lot of elements like that. Some of the stuff that I'm interested in, um, like, like you said, Star Wars, and even some little toys that I have. Um, and a lot of, still a lot of NBA stuff, a lot of basketball stuff, a lot of uh, motorcycle stuff. Yeah, huge collector. Yeah, no, well, yeah, I'm trying not to be such a big uh, collector for stuff that's, um, I guess, Worthless. <laughs> Wait, I mean, memories. Memories, yes. memories. But you know, I do, I do want to declutter also a little bit more. Now that, now that it's you know nice and arranged and everything's fixed up, I do. I realize, okay, I still need to declutter more. Mm -hmm. So there's still stuff I need to get rid of. Um, and so I'm slowly doing that upstairs. When I got back, in fact, I was sitting in the in the in the office, and I looked around. The stuff are still kind of. On the, on the floor, so I'm like, okay, I need to get rid of these. Mm -mm. So I need to have put them in patch, batches already. That stuff that I need to get rid of. So it's good. It's good that I, I finally, see, because before, right, it wasn't my place wasn't so big, so I didn't really care. Mm, yeah. So now that it's fixed, I'm like, okay, I need. It's a psychological yeah, thing and environment. Yeah, and I needed new energy. And I needed new energy in my place that I needed to draw from. So before, this, this was just paint. So all the oils, all the dume, na stick jan. So this is not just for aesthetic purposes, but also for function. Subway tiles. Na black. This part, we just extended it, bar area, for extra seats for two plus, um, for decluttering, because it's super damn clutter. And also this, we're gonna show a clip before and after. It was metal bars, tapos wood. So I decided na actually we decided to take it off. Tapos mga solid mahogany na lang without the metal bars. Para hindi masadong bulky. Tapos here, itong area na nandito is ah uh, my client wanted his gloves here. Tapos yung shoes niya. Then I realized if he's gonna go out, para magmotor and stuff. So everything here, he can use. So very functional area for storage. Before, kasi parang junk lang siya, like magazines, random stuff. Yung stuff dyan na may story, nilabas din namin. Then, ito, of course, the trophy wall. So we made the bricks. Uh, again, we do your fall finishes. We do lime washes. We do cement, we do bricks, we, we can do marble, foam marble, anything under the sun. So, ano na lang, creativity and imagination, we, all, we, all, we do that for our clients. So, kasi wallpaper, kasi the problem with wallpaper, natatanggal siya. So, and this one, there would be no problem in the condo unit for load-bearing walls. That's yan. Ito. So, yeah, grand champion. First place, then also Kobe, 
na may signature o sa Muhammad Ali, Koto, Pacquiao, so lahat. Actually, ito, nasa, nakakalat lang siya before with no proper uh, place to it. So, yeah. Another storage here. Then, I wanted the no-handle look para clean. All of the charges we don't we don't then put the handle. This is solid mahogany wood. It's really really heavy, like the big solid chunk of mahogany. Again, we do not use nara because endangered wood na pusha. So I'm against using it. We only use nar uh, mahogany, acacia, and other wood except nara. Um, and here we just repurpose, reuse the sofa. So this was the sofa before. It was there. Tapos to open up the space is here na lang. Plus the TV is placed there. So while he's dining, eating breakfast, he can still watch the TV. Tapos another storage, very loud, very cool. Art pieces from famous people we all love and know, <laughs> from Filipino artists. So. This one, like Erlina, Benta, Amor Solo, and also he supports artists. Like this one, kind of startup artist lang. Uh, itong Sakura. So we also put that. And also this interesting sculpture na actually gumagalap I really love this piece. Also, here, more of the storage lang. And this was the wall before, so we kept it. The cement stucco wall. Again, everything else is Achromatic, so neutral colors, browns, grays, blacks, and whites. So um, I suggested a color na medyo midnight blue, because this is the eclectic side. So para makita talaga yung personality ng client. Um, he, this is the parang weird eclectic side, like he's a deep person, <laughs> very creative as well. Tapos any colors kaya, like this one could match this one, even that the horn. Tapos ito, very pop art tong part na to. Well, this area is very um, national artist, ganun. Very parang alam mong collector, like a very uh, may eye talaga for artists, this area. This one very ano, modern. This one was a chair before also. Then we hid all the wiring, kasi clutter rin. Ang daming, kasi pag nakikita yung, nakikita ni Sir Wires, na, ano na siya, na OC. <laughs> I think anyone on my would, especially if it's your home. Thus, this area, we also decluttered it. We, we actually had a yard sale um, during the process of renovation. We sold a lot then, so yeah. So, going upstairs na is his vlog room and his bedroom. So, of course, this is his fun side, like the geek side of the client, of the bachelor. So, yeah, very Star Wars. Um, tapos also an NBA fan, like really like personality dito, like really, really loud. Pero it's an office space as well. So yun. Um, lahat ng collectors. Yeah, actually kulang pa yan, madami pang stuff here. But yeah, we made this brick wall again. Kasi brick, very masculine and ano, industrial feel. Kahit actually, kahit mukhang mahal yung Unit me, sir. We made it budget friendly. We were actually under a budget. There was a leak here. Like, lahat pala, not, not just here. Like, all the units may leak. Of course, dapat medyo out of the box then. Plus, the function of the wall. Actually, dyan may tulo na. Okay? If you zoom that in, <coughs> may tulo na siya. Medyo nag the dark green na. She did this for two to three days. So, yeah, distressed wall, distressed finish. Tapos, a mix. Mixed media siya ng um, different kinds of cements. So we use the browns, the grays, yeah, to make that distress finish. And ano siya, yung texture niya really ano, very textured. Wala pa siyang kid, so ito, safe naman sa kanya to.
guys and thank you Mr. Gino Rufino for thank you. for trusting us. Again, we are Rocks Interiors. You can follow us at our YouTube channel, Instagram, and email us at this. Thank you. Bye.